Apart from winning her maiden Grand Slam at the age of 19, what else do you know about Iga Swiatek? She astonished the tennis world by winning the 2020 French Open as an unseeded player. She was born in Warsaw, Poland in 2001. Shiontek has a special position in tennis history along with 19-year-old British adolescent Emma Raducanu, who won the 2021 US Open at the age of 18. Her entire life has been a masterpiece and we bring to you some fascinating facts about Iga Shiontek. So stay till the end and don't forget to subscribe. Number 1. She started out like Agnieszka Radwańska. Radwańska and Wyatek both made their Grand Slam debuts in their sixth and inaugural quarterfinal appearances, respectively. Radwańska made her Grand Slam debut at Wimbledon in 2006, and on her seventh attempt, she reached her maiden quarterfinal in the Australian Open in 2008. Wyatek made her Grand Slam debut in Australia in 2019, and on her eighth attempt, reached her maiden quarterfinal in Paris in 2020. Wimbledon 2020 was postponed. Despite Radvinska being a few months younger than Viatek, who was 19 years and 126 days old, both were still in their teen years. Number 2. Her father was an Olympian Viatek hails from a sports family. Her father, Thomas, was a talented rower in his earlier years. He competed for Poland at World Championships and the 1988 Seoul Olympics in the men's quadruple skulls. When it comes to my daughter's tennis career, I've learned from my failures. Hopefully, whatever didn't work with the older one will with the younger one. Thomas once made a joke. Number 3. She enjoys reading historical fiction Ildefonso Falcone's Cathedral of the Sea was a book she really loved. She also reads Kent Follett's historical works, but she admitted that they are often quite thick. When she needs something more manageable, she turns to Dan Brown or some mystery fiction. Number 4. She attends competitions with a psychologist Sports psychologist Daria Abramovich travels with coach Pitur Sierspotovsky to Witex competitions and is a permanent member of the coaching staff. It's no accident that a psychologist is here. When she was younger, she frequently battled her emotions on the court, exploding after a poor play and losing control of the game. I get a ton of assistance from Daria. She made sure I was ready for the fight before the match in Paris against Simona Halla. I was able to act independently. Because of that, I've got the Romanian. Number 5. She listens to rock music Pearl Jam, Red Hot Chili Peppers, Pink Floyd, Santana, Coldplay, ACDC. It's not an old school radio hit parade, but Shiratek's playlist. How come she's so fascinated with rock music from the past? She explains. When I was going to tournaments, that's the music my coaches listened to and it just stayed with me. I grew fond of it. My fascination with older music is because music had more value to it in the past. It had a greater spirit, triggered emotions, and was less synthetic. Number 6. She has a Wimbledon title Her greatest accomplishment was winning Wimbledon in 2018 when she defeated Leon Kung of Switzerland 6-4, 6-2, and became the fourth pole to win a junior title on the London Lawn Courts, joining Agnesia, Ursula, and Alexandra Alsa. She and Maha Hualiska reached the Australian Open Junior Doubles Championship final in 2017. Together with American Katie McNally, she won her maiden junior Grand Slam doubles match under Roland Garros courts in 2018. Number 7. She's a crazy cat lady She enjoys cats. There's currently only one black grappa in her home, but one day, she'll want to have more. Where did grappa get its name? She smiled. Well, it's easy to figure out. After an Italian vacation, was their home tasting? Number 8. She played for Alicia Warsaw It wasn't a coincidence if you've ever seen White Tech at Alicia Warsaw football game. She spent a few years playing tennis for the club, practicing on their courts and posing for pictures with a recognizable L. Number 9. She adores Mad Men Witek responds without hesitating to the question about her favorite show, Mad Men. She disclosed, This series captures the early days of American advertising in an interesting way, while maintaining a cool retro vibe because it is set in the 1960s. It's important to me to be able to learn something new from a series. Number 10. Rafael Nadal is her favorite tennis player. Wojtek has been a longtime supporter of Rafael Nadal and continues to do so. Why? Then she said, I respect him as a player and for his tenacity. He's a role model. Rafa is a tennis warrior who never gives up until the very last second. Furthermore, I appreciate his high topspin style of play since I also enjoy playing that manner. He won multiple tournaments thanks to his amazing left-handed forehand. As a tennis player, who is in the league of his own, 
Roger Federer is someone I like and respect, but when it comes to flair and personality, I'm more into Rafa because I adore his energy. Sorry. That's all. If you enjoy the video, do like, share, comment, and subscribe. See you next time.